And every good woman wants to be submissive to her husband. But are you the type of man that a woman will submit to? And there are a lot of things that women wish that men knew about women. Yes, you heard that right. Okay? And there are a lot of things. So many things that women wish. Your woman wish. I wish. Every woman wishes that men just, just know this about women. Okay? And let me tell you three things that women wish that men knew about them. All right. Now, hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. This is Real Talk with IJ. On here, we talk about all things love, sex, and relationship as it concerns the men. I try to help you understand women and pick the best person for you. If you're already subscribed, thank you so much. If you're new here, hi, and I hope you stay and I hope you subscribe. All right. So let us not waste anybody's time. Let us talk about these three things that women wish that men knew. Firstly, and I'm saying this with all seriousness, and I don't know how you guys are going to feel about it, but women want you to lead. You need to be a leader as a man. Okay, you need to learn how to lead. You cannot be allowing your woman to take the lead all the time. We want you to be the head of the family. And it doesn't matter if your woman is any more money than you. It doesn't matter if your woman is providing more than you. You just need to learn how to lead. Learn how to do it. Learn how to take charge. Whether it's in the bedroom, whether it's in the finances. The thing about women is if you step down, we will step up naturally we will step up if we see that you are not stepping up we will naturally take charge and especially when we don't see you doing much we automatically take the position of the leader in the family now do we really like it no do we really want to control our husbands no do we really want to tell you what to do no do we want to be smarter than you no a lot of women forget about this feminism stuff people are just you know misinterpreting it and all of that like yes we want to be able to express ourselves as women but we don't want to do it on top of your head we don't want to stand on top of you okay we want to be able to say oh that's my man he's going to do this oh my man is my man is my man that, that's what a lot of women want you know when we are together as women it's a thing of pride for a lot of women oh my man does this oh my man this oh my man that we don't want to compete with you any woman who is even wanting to be in a competition with you in a relationship is not good for you. Yet yeah, when you say yes, yeah, she says no. No, we have to do it this way. Your woman should be able to trust your decision. That's where you know you are a man in that relationship. That's where you know you have succeeded in that relationship. When you can say something, your woman says, mm, okay, yes, that's it. That's what we're doing. That way you know that you are the king in your, in your relationship okay if you're in a relationship where she constantly counters everything you say maybe because you have under delivered a lot of times sometimes it's possible maybe you have under you have you have embarrassed yourself a lot of times so now she doesn't trust you to do anything she takes charge of everything because you're not going to you're going to be useless if you, if you ask to do it and that's very bad so if this is the case you need to rediscover yourself you need to learn how to take charge back in your relationship. It's very, very important. One thing a man needs desperately in his, in his relationship and marriage is respect from your woman. And if you cannot lead, how can the woman respect you? How can a woman submit to you if you don't even know how to be superior to her? How can she submit to you? How can she respect you if she knows that you can never deliver anything? So as a man, you need to take it upon yourself to lead learn how to take charge every woman every good woman wants to be submissive to her husband but are you the type of man that a woman will submit to ask yourself that question and answer yourself all right good secondly every woman wants you to know that we want your attention not just your provision now i know even under my comment sections on youtube a lot of men say oh just have money oh just have just give her money just give her money it's very sad but that doesn't work all the time Money does not fix everything. Women still want you to see them. You know when you're chasing a woman, you act as if she's your everything. If she fixes the lashes, you know. If she, if she rubs wet lips today, you know. If she has black liner today, you remember she had blue one yesterday. If she changes her hairdo, you know everything. You remember what she wore to the first date. You remember what she wore the first day you saw her. When you are chasing her, you remember everything. But all of a sudden, when she's now yours, a lot of you forget that you need to still keep chasing. Now, not like you're chasing her to lose focus of your life, but you need to keep letting your woman know that I still see you. If your woman comes back from the, from, from the, from the salon or comes back from work, you notice that, oh, you're wearing a new perfume today. I like that. Oh, wait, I love this earring on you. You look so nice. 
oh this hair really looks nice on you notice we want your attention and your affection a lot of men will say oh please i provide what do you want me to do didn't i give you money what do you want me to do didn't i provide for the children's school fees what do you want me to do this i provide money for food what do you want me to kill myself sometimes we want you to just sit and cuddle and let's watch tv together sometimes that's all women want now i'm not saying that you don't have to provide as a man as much as you are providing you need to still give your attention to your woman because you will agree with me that a lot of women are now providing also. A lot of women women can provide. If you let a woman work, a lot of them will happily work and provide money also. All right? But that attention you're giving to her, she cannot give to herself. That's something she cannot give to herself. So you have to give her. You have to give her that attention and affection. That's all she wants. That's why a lot of times you see a lot of people who are married to very wealthy men, they're still cheating. They still, they're still caught in the hotel with another man. And you're like, what is wrong with this woman? This man is giving her everything, giving her money. She's flying private jet. Right? Still, she cheats. It's because she's lacking affection from you. The woman still wants you to see her. So that's your woman that you have neglected because you think you're giving her heaven and earth by giving her cash. Go home today and give her a peck on the cheek and tell her you are beautiful. Go appreciate your woman today. Women want you to know that they want attention and affection as much as you give them provision they still want this okay so try and balance it try as much as possible to balance this and lastly women want you to know that we can handle more than you think you know a lot of times men look at women as fragile oh you're too weak they won't understand sometimes you're talking most men when men are talking man to man they're like oh she's my woman she's not going to understand her she's not going to have you even tried you just sometimes especially when you're going through a really difficult situation maybe your family is going through something maybe financially you're going through something maybe in your comp maybe you've just even lost your job a lot of men are even sometimes they can't even tell their woman that they've lost their job they go and try as much as possible just to be providing just to be providing but they've lost their job because they feel oh she's not going to understand she's not going to understand why do you think women cannot handle it Say it, say it as it is. If, have you lost your company? Have you been duped? Is something happening? Are you important? Have you just found out that you cannot have kids? Tell your woman. Stop keeping women in the dark. Sometimes that woman might have the solution that you have been begging millions of friends to help you fix. She might have a solution that will solve everything in one second. So stop assuming that your woman will not understand stop assuming that we cannot handle stuff tell women how it is i know some women might not be able to handle it sometimes you tell us and we even woo, we go off the roof and we get angry we get pissed but in that anger and in everything if a woman loves you she immediately begins to look for a solution she immediately begins to think of a way to fix it because women are fixers we are home builders we're like mother nature we like to fix things we like to see things beautiful so begin to trust your woman from today begin to trust that she can handle stuff no matter how difficult you think it is if that woman loves you talk to her tell her exactly her babe i'm owing this person this babe i lost this money babe i lost this contract babe this happened babe this customer fucked me over babe this happened babe this happened and watch how she's going to help you fix some of those issues that you think are impossible for her to even understand so I hope today you have learned something. You see, sometimes we come here and we talk something really serious apart from sex and all of that. So it's important that you follow my channel back to back because you don't know what to expect. You don't know what to expect. But just know that you always get the best out of this channel every time you come online. So don't forget to share my videos as much as you can. Don't forget to like my videos and make sure you drop a comment to let me know that you appreciate what I'm doing here. And guys, don't forget that it is still my best month and my birthday is on the 10th of October. I have a wish list and if you want to buy me something, please check in my description box for the list and I will appreciate whatever you can afford to send to me. So until next time, keep living life, keep being champs and bye for now. Mwah.